Miss Rajasthan, the place where I live. But this is also Rajasthan, a place where girls are often treated as a burden. My name is Pooja. My parents married me off when I was one and a half months old. My grandfather had just died and all our relatives had gathered. So, my parents decided to save money on a separate wedding feast later and married me off at that time itself. People in my community think that educating girls is a complete waste. That is why they spend money on sending the boys to school. While girls stay at home and do housework. So, like most women in our tribe, my mother cannot read or write and will spend all her life doing hard labor like this. One day, without even asking my father, she just took me away from home and put me in this school nearby. My father was really angry, but my mother said she wanted me to study so that I could have a better life. So now, for the first time in my life, I am in school. It is called Kasturba Gandhi Balika Vidyale or KGBV. I really like living with my friends here. Every morning, we get up and get ready quickly. We have learned to brush our teeth, use a toilet and be clean and tidy. Morning exercises are great fun. And I love the food here. In just one or two months, I started looking so good that my mother didn't even recognize me. And you know, even though I never went to school before, my teachers have helped me to catch up in my studies in just a few months. Now, I can read and write. I can do sums. But my favorite is computer class. I never thought that school could be so much fun. When I go home, I tell everyone we must be clean and tidy. I still help my mother, but now there is one small change. If my brother has any problems in his studies, I am able to help him too. People in my village still tell my mother, what's the use of educating Pooja? As if you are going to make her a politician or something. My mother just smiles and says that the school is free, so it is no extra burden on her. And when I grow up and get a job, then my life will be much better than what anyone in the village could ever imagine. I really hope I can make her dreams come true.